I remember going out to the university for the first time. I went a week early. I remember being a little bit homesick and going into the coach's office. And sure enough, there's a guy sitting there. He had had his leg amputated at that time. And uh, there was so much for me going in to complain about being homesick. I, you know, I quickly bit my tongue and sat there. And uh, he, he ended up leaving the office. And I said to the coach, who, who was that? It turned out to be Terry Fox. And with that one encounter, the course of Jay Triano's life was changed. A 19-year-old Terry Fox, just a few months removed from amputation, was slated to be the varsity basketball team's trainer for the upcoming season. To see him on a continual basis um, and taping ankles and stuff, you start to you get to know him a little bit better. He would tell us, he says, I have this dream and I'm going to run across Canada. And, uh, you know, and we, we all kind of just looked at him like, Okay, that's your dream, that's cool. And never thinking that anything like that would ever happen. But it wasn't long before Triano realized he had underestimated his newfound friend. And I remember taking the bus up Burnaby Mountain and going up the hill. And uh, here I am motivated because it's 8 o'clock in the morning and I'm going to go up and get shots up. And at the same time as I go by in the bus, I look out the window and here's my friend wheeling his wheelchair up the mountain. I remember getting up to the gym and shooting and then all of a sudden here he would come wheeling in to the gymnasium wanting to get some shots up completely soaked and uh, I was just like wow this is crazy and then I'd go down to the weight room and then he'd be down there lifting weights. All of a sudden this dream that was way out there and that nobody believed in and to hear him and see him and, and know how inspired he was you just knew okay this, this thing is actually going to happen. Terry's actually going to do this.